choice! Oh, I think I'm hungry! Ah, definitely! What beautiful dances I have. I'm having fun. But who is shouting there? I think I should go. What an interesting book! Huh? Oh, what is it? I hear my granddaughter screaming. I'll rush to help. This ice cream is so delicious. But what is it? Hmm, we must hurry faster. I'm running to you, Joe. I want to eat. I want to eat. Feed me. Oh. Give me glasses here. Donut. Will you make one? Let's see. Yeah, I will. I'm ready. Oh, I'd love to make this donut for you. First, I'll pour the dough into this donut maker. Okay, I'll fill in all the spots. That's it. Perfect. Now I'll close it. And wait a little. And I'll make the perfect rainbow donuts. Because simple donuts are so boring. Mine will be the most rosy, the most fun, and of course the most delicious. I'll definitely win this challenge. Oh, what a good fellow you are. That's awesome. You will succeed. But what about you? Of course, black donuts are the tastiest, but something is missing. Of course, a delicious sauce. Hand, help me with this. Come on. Okay. Oh, what a nightmare! I'm afraid of it! Give me the bowl here. Okay. Now I have a place to pour strawberry sauce in. And now I'll use this. It'll be more convenient to decorate donuts this way. That's what I need. We need to cheer them up. Oh, what is it? What is this? It's just strawberry sauce. Oh, you scared me. That was ridiculous. Now I'll decorate my donuts with sauce and most delicious icing. The decoration is just brilliant. They're beautiful and delicious. Some scary ones. And my beautiful donuts are ready. I'll spread them out and sprinkle with powdered sugar. This is so classic. Very tasty recipe. Yes, this is what you need. Look! Very good. Cool. Looks good! And look at my donuts! My most rosy ones! Very nice donuts! Just a sight! I want to sprinkle them with sprinkles! It doesn't open! What a tight lid! Open! Oh no! Oops! <laughs> okay. I'll sprinkle them like this. Yeah, this combination is the most delicious. Okay, dear, eat it. How delicious! This is a very interesting donut. And it's funny. I'll try it. Hmm, it's quite tasty. So beautiful. I like it. What you need. And these? Hmm, so simple. I'll try the next one. Wow! These are rainbow donuts! They smell so good! Mmm! How delicious! All the donuts turn out to be good, but which ones to choose? Of course, these ones! I'm very happy. How do you open this? I want pasta! Prepare it for me! It's like boiling water. So, I will quickly prepare the most delicious pasta. That's almost it. Hmm. What do I have here? Probably hot. Hand over here. Now you're going to help me find out if the water has boiled. No! Thanks. I see it is boiled. Hand, are you burnt? No? It was very hot. So the water is ready. <laughs> what are you going to do? I think I'll make the pasta myself. Oh, I'm covered in flour. <laughs> but it's okay. 
<laughs> it's even a bit of fun. That's better. I'll put the flour on a board. And now I'll make real handmade pasta. Be sure to add eggs, salt. Now I'm going to knead this dough. It's not easy, of course, but it'll be very tasty. I will have the most unusual pasta. I'll make individual pieces and, of course, I'm going to add something extra. I will add paints. That's it. I'll have pasta in all colors of the rainbow. The most beautiful lilac pasta. Now I will form a piece. I'll have several of these. And now I will cut them into small pieces and, of course, use a grater. This will give them shape. Well, the pasta goes into the pan. You're so good. What a smart girl. So my pasta is quite ready. Then you probably need to add some ketchup. Oh. Oh, uh, uh, I can't see anything. My glasses. Oh, is it ketchup after all? Or not ketchup? We need to squeeze out more. Grandma, let me help you. We need to open it. Hold it. Oh, oh I think I'm all smeared in ketchup. Um, yeah, it's definitely ketchup. Oops. We need to be more careful. Don't laugh. I made my pasta. Uh, oops. Actually, much better this way. <laughs> it's already done. Now into the plate. Something is clearly missing. And to me. Now we'll make this pasta prettier. Cuttlefish ink is what I need. Black has never heard before. I will make my pasta. Awesome. Oh, what a black, gloomy, beautiful pasta. Now that's what it needs. The only thing it lacks is red. Adding some ketchup. I'll pour it on top. <laughs> so beautiful, bud. It will be even better with the eyes. <gasps> what is it? Uh, oh, she's like always. I got such a rainbow pasta. I just want to eat it. Hooray! Try it, Jill. <laughs> um, this is a strange dish. Need to try it, but honestly, I don't want to. It doesn't look delicious. Ugh, it's disgusting. Ugh. And I want this pasta. Mmm, that's delicious. Okay. I would love to eat this pasta. Oh, this is what I need. It's so beautiful. Mmm, I love it. That's the winner. Hooray! There it is. I've beaten you guys. We need to prepare. I want a drink. Delicious and sweet. Hand, okay. are you ready? Okay. I'm ready. Oh, I almost fell. What is there? Oh, got that. Hey. Should I start? Please. Okay. okay. So, I will take very beautiful but sour candies. They will help me to implement my idea. So, I'm going to put them in the molds. There'll be a multicolored miracle. I took them because they're so beautiful. Oh, um, they're over. Well, okay. The mitten in place. And I'll put them in the oven. It'll be necessary to warm them up a little. That's it. And now it's time to cool my dish. I'm going to pull it out of the mold. What a beauty turned out. Oh yeah, gorgeous goes, but pretty sour. Now I'll take M&Ms. And of course, sort them by color. It'll be even more beautiful this way. Huh? How delicious it is! I'll add M&Ms to the drink and of course fill it with Sprite. What a delicious cocktail! It'll be even tastier with cream. It's very cool. With sprinkles, it's going to be delicious. And beautiful. And tiny straws. It's something incredible. I will make my granddaughter a very healthy celery cocktail. I'll take the whole one. I think I can do it. 
Oh, come on! It's disgusting! She'll probably won't like it. Well, my most healthy cocktail for my granddaughter is ready. Beautiful and so many vitamins! Top it with a spring of celery and a straw. It's very cool. No. no. Hand a glass. I'll take a proper glass and, of course, smear with strawberry syrup. Hmm, what should I pour here? Perhaps it'll be Sprite. Of course, I'll add the dye. And stir it all with the rice straw. Hand, help. Okay. Oh, oh, you scared me again! Once they take it away! Hand, hurry up. <laughs> Super thanks, Hand. Cream is just right. It is very similar to brains, but for the best effect, I'll pour red syrup. And put an eye and a spider on top. That's delicious. Perfect. <laughs> Everyone has different tastes. Try mine! How beautiful! I'll try this cocktail. Oh, it's very good! And delicious! Huh? And this one? <laughs> I won't even try this one. No! I'll try this. How delicious! Delicious! An edible glass? Oh, it's sour! But this drink is very tasty. It's the winner! I'll have another one. Hooray! I won again! I'm so glad! What a terrible hand Wednesday has! Just awful! This time, I want a burger! I hope you won't disappoint me! Okay. It'll be done! Easy! Okay. I haven't cooked burgers yet, but I think there's nothing complicated about it! Where's the knife? Here it is! <laughs> Wednesday, please be careful with the knife! These are no toys! Well, you need to cut the bun in half! And fry each half in a frying pan! <laughs> After that, you can start cooking the cutlet. It does not matter at all whether it turns out to be smooth or not. The main thing is that this is really delicious. And a little cheese won't hurt. Now you can start making the burger. A bun, a lettuce leaf, color with cheese and a little sauce. Ta-da! The burger is ready. No. Cool. Now it's my turn. He can't catch a bun! Oh, I, I think I scared it. Didn't mean to. No more frying pan. It's okay. I'm going to cook my signature sweet burger for Cindy. She'll definitely be absolutely delighted with it. Instead of buns, I'm using donuts, some chocolate on top. And moving on. Some delicious sauce. This is actually so sour but so good! And now, some marshmallows and marmalades. Strawberry syrup. And I'll cover the burger with another part of the donut. There's so much sugar! I plan to outdo us all and make more than just a burger. It'll be a burger in the form of a head. First, I need to fry cutlet. Big and juicy. I will use, of course, black buns on which I'll put a piece of cheese. Cheese, by the way, should be cut as I show. I'll make two holes in the top bun. And bring me some mustard. Some holes. And now, I'm gonna put mustard in there. And you better hurry up. Okay. Pouring it right in. Now, I'll make a tongue from a cucumber. And the rest of the ingredients. Some sauce on top. The burger is almost ready. It remains only to insert the eyes on toothpicks into it. Look at what creepy head. It's ready to devour everyone. Cindy, hurry up and eat it. How cool! Oh, Wednesday, you're scaring me again! By the way, the burger looks cool. Are those marmalade eyes? They are the very ones! I love them! Now let's see what the burger itself tastes like! 
the idea to make it in the shape of a hat is just brilliant! Very tasty! I'm thrilled! But in order to not overeat, I'll move on to the next participant. Let's see what grandma has prepared for me. Your burger, of course! It's delicious! But it's kind of ordinary. I was waiting for more. Let's see what Rainbow has done. Her burger looks unreal! I think it's delicious. Delicious but still sweet. And I wanted to have lunch, so Wednesday wins this round. Finally. I knew that victory would come. I am thirsty this time. Surprise me with a cocktail. I can surprise you. It'll be done. A cocktail, you say? I'll try it. And don't bother me. Well… How are these fancy milkshakes being prepared there? Apparently first you need to use milk. But it will be better if you melt a whole chocolate bar in it. Let's put it in. And stir it well. I'll serve the cocktail in a branded mug. I hope Cindy will be happy. I know she likes cacao, so I hope she likes mine. Plain cacao is boring. Why not make a cocktail according to a more cool recipe? First, I need a bar of white chocolate. I'll take a bite and melt the rest of milk. White chocolate won't turn a cocktail into brown goo. Now, a little sugar. Just a little? Of course. The main thing is that it is delicious. Now you can add some milk. Oh, ouch! Oh! Uh, got a little dirty, but okay. The milk is delicious, so that means I'm delicious too. To make my cocktail brighter, I'll drop some food coloring. It'll be very beautiful. Let's stir it now. Perfect. You can also experiment with the feeling. For example, why not serve a cocktail in a decorated jar? I think Cindy will appreciate such a gesture. Pouring it in. And now it's time to add some whipped cream, because it'll definitely not be superfluous. Everyone loves it, even me. And don't forget about marshmallows. Now a straw. Ready. Cool. Wednesday. Oh, okay. I will also make a very original cocktail. Firstly, it will be in a cool mug in the form of a skull. Now some strawberry syrup. It will look great. And then I'll pour the usual cacao inside. But I still also establish it with whipped cream, so it'll be a little more interesting. I also have marmalades in the form of bats. Cindy will definitely like it. Ready. Cindy, it's time to pick the winner. Hmm. Wednesday, let's start with your cocktail. It looks terrifying again. I'm definitely not going to eat this creepy marmalades. Delicious, bud. Looks like the most ordinary cacao. Let's see what grandma has prepared. She has the cutest mug of all! Whoa. And a cow again. Too easy. Rainbow's cocktail looks much more interesting. I hope I'll be delighted with it. Wow, so many toppings! There, this is a real cocktail! Rainbow, this time the victory is yours. <laughs> Hooray! I tried very hard. Subscribe to Parara because this is where the most interesting and funny challenges are waiting for you. Our heroes are always ready to cheer you up.